sort of opened my eyes because of such a cool feeling you get. It's something you really can't describe until you actually experience it. The water's glass, there is barely any wind around you and it's just the, just the apparent wind from you moving along the water. It's such a surreal feeling. You have a lot of constrictions on a lighter kite design. The weight is really critical. Maintaining a, enough projected area to create lift is, is important. When you make a high projected area kite, which is like a flat kite, then that flat kite is slow to turn and difficult to relaunch. So there's a lot of variables to blend in a lighter kite. We wanted to have a, a relatively high projected area. Uh, we didn't want the kite to be too flat because we want it to be uh, more stable and able to relaunch better. And we chose three struts to support the canopy in the middle and the wingtips. We had to refine the tube size to have the kite have a, a natural stability structurally, but not be too heavy and too draggy. And then the final factor was the bridle. It's a non-pulley, non-slider bridle. It's a fixed bridle. And the idea there is that it's a, a simple bridle that won't give the, the kite a sloppy feel. We want it to have a nice firm feel. The profile of the kite is fairly far forward so that the kite is stable overhead. So it's very critical that the kite has stability. Even if there's no wind, it has to be stable and, and drift back. I would say I have no problem relaunching the kite. The kite relaunches effortlessly. The good thing about it is it's actually kept its performance factor. Pretty impressed by it. I was riding in like 10 knots pretty much and I was doing pretty much all my single passes. So yeah, I think it's a fun toy to have. Um, I would definitely want to get one myself so I can actually still kite, you know, with a set light. And you pretty much still do your tricks in uh, that lighter wind. And uh, it's still a fast kite. You can, still, you can still do loop tricks as well. So it's a fun kite to have for a light wind day. I'd say eight knots, you should be able to, to, to sort of go along with a, with a decent lighter board and stay, hold your position. That's, that's the minimum, sort of the minimum goal. <laughs>